not have the energy required. I do not have the energy required. Not do that here. Welcome, friend. You know, they're saying you intend to enter Bloodmire Manor. I have a bad feeling about that place myself. If you need weapons or armor to protect you from someone else's, you've come to the right place.
Welcome back, friend. My prices are always more than fair, friend. What are you looking for?
not have the energy required. I do hope this letter finds you well. Your last shipment of supplies and gold has been most generous. I have sent a special gift to your warehouse. His name is Argesh, the pinnacle of my creations. He will serve you without question. I hope he is to your satisfaction, as the others will be based off this new design. Please inform the Hands of Glory that fresh supplies will be needed, preferably live. Faithfully yours, Luvia Bloodmire. Welcome back, friend. My prices are always more than fair, friend. What are you looking for?
he finally arrived. I do hope my creations haven't given you too much trouble. Hmm, lovely, aren't they? It took me years to perfect the technique to successfully transfer limbs and organs from one creature to the next. What does it matter? Perhaps hundreds died for me to learn this. But it was a small price to pay in the name of science. But you shouldn't concern yourself over the welfare of others. Your thoughts should lie in the here and now. Fame is not always a friend. I've heard of your coming, and have had time to prepare these just for you. Try not to play too hard. I might still have use for you later. Provided your body isn't too mutilated. Farewell. destroyed, and by the likes of someone as insignificant as you! Heretics! Non-believers! You stand in my path to Goddom. Soon, nothing but the dead shall remain in this place. I will take my leave now. I suggest you do the same before it's too late. Hurry. Hurry. Hurry.
Stouter stuff than I. Baldur's Gate sleeps easier with Ruby above my on her monster's gun. As do I. My thanks. I hear many terrible malformed creatures fled Bloodmire Manor. City guards killed several, but some escaped. What happened? I see. So it was her vile creations that have been causing so much havoc each night. I'm glad you put an end to it, though it's a shame you could not have put an end to her, the evil woman. Here, my congratulations and your reward. The Hands of Glory. A band of vicious criminals are responsible. The ransom demands are ridiculous, far beyond the means of even the wealthiest victims' families. Some think it all merely a sadistic excuse to send back severed body parts. The city guard knows a frontal attack could result in the murder of the hostages. Many families think a small group would have the best chance of success. This is you. My, uh, less savory friends have informed me of where the victims are held. A Hands of Glory lair hidden beneath an old warehouse in southwest Baldur's Gate. The Hands? They're the new thieves' guild in Baldur's Gate, a band of assassins that took advantage of the power vacuum created when the last guild was destroyed. Murderous scum, all of them. No one knows who leads them. Well met again, adventurer. I've heard little. Only that adventurers are hard up for work in the city. So many came to fight Eldrith, but she's already been vanquished. What happened? There... Well, it's been done. Three adventurers journeyed into the wild. I met them once, when they came into the Elfsong Tavern. I came into the city with a society of... adventurer.
to be locked. have the energy required I do not have the energy required Oh! 
energy required. Yeah. <laughs> 
Welcome. Say, a little bird told me you aim to take on the hands of glory. Careful, friend. They're a mean lot. Watch your back. And maybe buy some armor for it, too. You'll find no other merchant with quality and prices to match mine. I've been supplying brave adventurers for over a decade. Seeking arms and armor? I have everything you need right here. Welcome back. It's simple. Or if you have magical equipment. Seeking arms and armor? I have everything you need right here. Thank <laughs> you. 
What were you doing? You were to guard the hostages and not harm them in any way. Was I unclear in my instructions, or perhaps you were purposely trying to anger me? Perhaps I should send you to Mistress Lumia. What do you think of that? Hacked up for spare parts, yes? <laughs> it sickens me to think that any part of your kind might have been used in my making. <laughs> you! You're in charge now. Lead the hostages back to your main camp. You Red Fangs can guard the miserable lot for a time. My spies have told me that there may be an attack on the Hands of Glory in an attempt to rescue them. Someone's here. Men, spread out and kill everyone you find.
Word of your success traveled quickly, friend. Here, the families of the freed send their warmest regards, along with this. Enjoy your reward. But who was this Argesh, their master? I see. Perhaps Argesh served whomever it was that paid Luvia Bloodmire to create him. Speak to Solace Dunkirk, captain of the city guard. He's somewhere on the streets. I've already spoken well of you to him, so he'll offer a lucrative task. Yes, I recently acquired an interesting map. It should lead to some ruins deep within the woods of Sharpteeth. Ruins likely filled with monsters and treasure. Interested enough to purchase it, adventurer? No, no, I couldn't part with it for that. No, no, I could... No, no, I couldn't... Yes, that will do nicely. Here you are, and best of luck. Well met again, Advent... I've heard little. Only... What happened? Well, it's been done. Randala to send strong, reliable adventurers my way. She spoke highly of you. As you may know, the city has been troubled by the Red Fang Marauders, whose main base we cannot find. Could I see that? Yes. This map indicates the exact location of the Red Fang's main camp in the Cloak Wood. Randala said you can handle the worst. What say I hire you on to take the Red Fangs out? No, that's no good. The forest is dense. Any sizable force would make such a racket that the Red Fangs could easily slip away. Or lay in wait with devastating ambushes. No, a small group would be best. Here, see? Move down the shore and approach from the eastern side. You'll have to traverse steep cliffs, but they won't be expecting an attack from there. Resistance should be light. Good luck, and may Helm guard your path. Greetings. I am Euros, priest of Helm. How might I assist you? I have heard of your good works in the city, but nothing more. Baldur's Gate is blessed by Helm to draw such valiant hearts. We are all grateful for your presence. May Helm watch over you. Farewell. Did not see you come in. Are you, um, did you, uh, should I have something prepared for you? 
Me? Oh, I, uh, well, that's easy. I'm, um, Armduil, sage and seer, for hire, uh, but not now. Uh, hiring, I mean. Uh, too much work, yes. Uh, too many projects already. Well, yes, of course you have. Of course, Armduil, sage and seer. Uh, seer, my good elf. <laughs> I thought you might come with questions about your past. I've reserved some time. Yes, just for you, but uh, my time is expensive, I warn you. I I'm an old man, and time is precious to me. Confirmations, then, yes? Always a good start. Uh, your name is indeed Isaran, as you surmise from that black tome you carry. Isaran Aundril. A noble name, yes? And noble it is, which you might have found had you not been turned away in the Grey Cloak Hills. A name of princes. You are no longer welcome in Evereska, last of the great hidden cities of the elves. Though I cannot yet tell you why.
That you're going after the Red Fangs? Best of luck, friend. They've been a thorn in the city's side for too long. Seeking arms and armor? I have everything you need right here. Up. Huh? 